Dan here at Country Pilgrim. I am on my way back to Lost Island Lake looking for the Lost Blarney Stone. What the heck is a Lost Blarney Stone anyway? No. What the heck is a Blarney Stone? If you are from Irish heritage, drop a comment below. You know what a Blarney Stone is. You ever heard of Blarney Castle over in Ireland? People will go over there, they'll seek that castle. They'll go all the way up to the top of it and there's a little gap, this little hole that they'll hang upside down to kiss that Blarney Stone. That's pretty cool. What does it mean anyway, huh? Does it mean that you get good luck if you kiss it? Does it mean that you get riches, a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow? Inquiring Irish minds want to know. So we're back at Ruthven, Iowa, and five miles north of Ruthven, Iowa is Lost Island Lake. We were here a few months ago, and we were working through the county park at Lost Island Lake, and as we put that footage out on YouTube, we had a couple of the locals that saw the video and got a hold of me and started to ask me questions like if I saw Electric Park, or did I see you know, where the, where the Blarney Stone was. As I started kind of going through the area, the history of Electric Park and what that was, they would string up electric lights along the shoreline on the south side of the lake people would come from all over because back in the day it was a big spectacle just to see electric lights and there was even a hotel and a resort that was famous back in the day called the baldwin hotel they were steamboats that would take people on rides around the lake and then what they would do is they'd come back to the baldwin hotel and they would tie up these steamboats on a large rock that was on the shore this large rock as I found out was the Blarney Stone. The issue that I'm running into is that this land on the South Shore particularly is private land. So I'm gonna have to try to meet some locals and see if there's a possibility that I can run along that shoreline looking for this Blarney Stone. Problem number two, I found out that that shoreline is nothing but large rocks. So it's gonna be hard to figure out which one of those rocks is the Blarney Stone. I don't know if there's a marking or whatever it is. And we are running up against St. Paddy's Day here. I thought this would be a really neat video to show if we can find that Blarney Stone. So let's go, let's see if we can find it. This is a really neat path that they have here in Lost Island Lake. Kind of goes along the marsh area. Oh cool, check this out. It gets you close to nature, it gets you up and close to the wildlife and the habitat around. And so we're a visitor here, so we're not going to be jumping in there and disrupting them too much, but you can kind of hear the Canadian geese in the background, not too happy that I'm kind of walking this path right now. But this runs really close to where Electric Park was and where that Blarney Stone was. So you kind of get a picture of what I'm trying to say as far as it's gonna be hard to try to find which one of the, these stones along this shoreline is the Blarney Stone. So you can kind of see the problem that I'm running up against here. This is the precise area where that Blarney Stone would be located. 
And oh my God, here it is. Pope people, here it is. I found the Blarney Stone. This is it. Who would have thought that I would have found, found it. Look at that. It's kind of fun to kind of think of what that Blarney Stone would have been like. We didn't find it. It was quite the adventure to kind of search the area, but you know, unless there is a local that presents himself to say, hey, I've got the Blarney Stone, it's here, but it sits on either on private land or it's off to the side, but anyway. Man, it frustrates me that I couldn't find that Blarney Stone. I'm hoping that at some point in the future, somebody catches this video, knows a little bit more about it, lets me know so I can come and find it. But it's kind of fun to pretend anyway, and you would think that that Blarney Stone was it a Blarney Stone? I don't know, could have been. But for the sake of this video, we'll just say that that was the Blarney Stone. <laughs>